कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर टाइप्स ऑफ कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर एंड फंक्शंस ऑफ इच टाइप्स ऑफ कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर दीज टॉपिक्स विल बी एक्सप्लेन इन डिटेल सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो कम्प्लीटली अबाउट कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर देन स्टे विथ मी हेलो एंड वेलकम एवरी वन लेट मी स्टार्ट विद द डेफिनेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर सो कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर इज अ सेट ऑफ प्रोग्राम दैट इज डिजाइन टू परफॉर्म अ वेल डिफाइंड फंक्शन इट इज द कलेक्शन ऑफ सिक्वेंस ऑफ इंस्ट्रक्शन एंड प्रोसीडियर्स दैट आर एबल टू परफॉर्म द टास्क सो द कलेक्शन ऑफ कोर्स और द इंस्ट्रक्शन और द सेट ऑफ प्रोग्राम्स दैट आर आर कैपेबल ऑफ डूइंग सम स्पेशल टास्क दे आर कॉल्ड द कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर operating systems like the windows 10 or windows 11 similarly the utilities program like the antivirus software or the backup software applications like word excel powerpoint even the browsing software like google chrome are some examples of computer software now the computer software is further categorized into two types that is system software and application software So let's understand what is system software. System software is the collection of programs that are designed to operate, control and manage all the activities of the computer system as well as overall computer and its part. Operating systems uh, like the Windows 10 or 11 utility programs like the antivirus are some examples of the system software. System software are of four types. like uh, the operating system utility software device drivers and language processor i start with the operating system so operating system is the type of system software that operates our computer system as well as controls and manages all the activities of the computer system actually it is the main software of the computer system windows 10 Linux Mac OS examples of operating system now let me tell you some of the major functions of operating system the major functions of operating system are it operates the computer and controls each and every activities of the computer system similarly it coordinates with the peripheral devices to help them work smoothly peripheral devices means the devices that are attached to our computer system like the keyboard mouse monitor printer and so on similarly it manages the input processing and output operations of the computer system it provides environment to run other applications in absence of operating system we cannot run other application software similarly it provides the security to our computer system it allows us to keep password in our computer system beside this there are other major functions of operating system for example the device management file management process management memory management and so on and the next system software is the utility software utility software is a type of system software that has the responsibility of maintaining computer hardware and data it helps to analyze configure monitor and maintain the computer system as well as the data inside the computer system antivirus software and the disk cleaning software like uh, disk cleaner or the backup software are some of the examples of utility software similarly another system software is the language processor language processor is a software that converts high level program code into the machine level code they are designed to convert the high level programming language into machine level language because our computer system does not understand high level programming language it needs to be converted to the machine level language so that it can understand and work properly so the source code of the high level programming language is translated by the language processor into the machine code so that our computer can understand and work according to the instructions that are included in the program similarly the device driver is another 
type of system software actually device driver are the special type of system software that are designed to manage the specific part of the computer system actually it helps to coordinate the peripheral devices of the computer system like the keyboard mouse monitor printer and so on with the operating system so that these devices can do the input and output operations smoothly and can perform well now let me tell you about the application software application software are the type of software that are designed to perform a special task only or a single task they can do only one task properly they are designed to satisfy the general or the specific need of a particular person or an organization for example ms word it is designed to prepare document only similarly the excel for maintaining the numerical records or numerical data or perform numerical calculations and powerpoint for creating presentations similarly the billing softwares or the banking software these are the application softwares that are designed to perform the single task properly so these are the some of the examples of application software now application softwares are of two types that is package software and customized software so let's see the package software package software is the ready-made software that is designed to fulfill the general need of the user or an organization actually package software are designed to carry out the functions that is needed by all the general people they perform the common task for example the ms office softwares like ms word ms excel or the powerpoint these software fulfill the general needs of the user or an organization from these softwares anyone can prepare uh, the document or create presentation with the help of powerpoint so they are the software that fulfill the needs of the general user so these type of software are called the package software that fulfills the need of the general user and can be used by anyone or any organization and the last one is the customized software so customized which is also known as the tailored software is a special type of application software that is designed to meet the requirement of a single organization or a person so they perform a single task but they are used by a particular person or an organization it cannot be used by the general persons or all the organizations for the common task for example the result processing software in the school or colleges are specific to that particular school or the college it cannot be used by all the college and the universities similarly the billing software of the supermarket banking software and the ATM software are some of the examples of customized software. So this is all about the computer software and its types. I hope you have understood. Now if you want to know about the computer hardware, you can click on the left video. And if you want to know about the input and output devices of the computer system, you can click on the right video. So see you in the next video.